Good day everyone, my name is Stephanie Nicolas, uh, BSCS for a students and in this video I will first give the description of each network devices and then give a tutorial on how to use them in Cisco Packet Tracer. Network Interface Card uh, NIC provides a computer with a dedicated full-time connection to a network. It implements the physical layer circuitry necessary for communicating with a data link layer standard such as Ethernet or Wi-Fi. Each card represents a device and can prepare, transmit, and control the flow of data on the network. So, for our first tutorial is using an IC or network interface card. So, una natin gagawin is maglalagay tayo ng server and two workstation. So, dito, para magamit natin yung NIC card, kailangan natin ng network media. So, click lang natin tong crossover cable. Click natin siya dito kay PC0. Then, click natin siya kay server. Then, piliin natin tong fast Ethernet 0. So, mapapansin natin na isa lang yung fast Ethernet. So, yung NIC card is siya yung port para may connect natin yung network media na crossover cable para magamit natin yung internet at makasend ng data sa workstation. So, napili na natin yung fast internet. So, mapapansin natin na wala ng available port. So, ang gagawin natin, click lang natin si server. Then, dito sa mga modules, pipiliin natin yung PT Host NM1CFE. So, ito yung NIC card. So, off muna natin yung server. Then, drag natin tong NIC card. Then, on natin ulit yung server. So, try natin ulit mag-connect ng cable. So, mapapansin natin na meron na ulit fast Ethernet. So, yun na yung NIC card. Hubs, MAUs, and repeaters. Hub is very simple network device that is used in LANs. It is basically a multi-port repeater. Hubs do not decide anything and forwards any traffic to all the ports. So, they are not smart devices. They have multiple ports that connects different network equipments in the same network. So, next na natin yung hubs, MAUs, and repeaters. So, let's design a network. Dito, kailangan natin ng two hubs. Having three workstation each and one repeater. So, mahahanap natin yung hubs dito na sa baba lang siya. Maglalagay tayo ng dalawang... Maglalagay tayo ng dalawa. Then, next is yung three workstation. So, yung hub is may 6 port siya. Gagamit lang tayo ng tatlo, then 1 repeater. Andito lang siya sa hub section. Choose natin tong PT repeater, then mag-connect tayo ng network media. Dito sa workstation, gagamit tayo ng straight through cable. Then, dito sa may repeater, instead na straight through cable, gagamit tayo ng crossover cable. So, ayan. So, ayan. Then, i-configure lang natin ulit yung mga workstation. Maglalagay tayo ng unique na IP address. So, Lagyan na natin.
So, try na natin siyang i-connect. So, ayan. Try natin siyang iting. So, ayan. Nag-reply. So, ibig sabihin is connected siya. Bridges and switches. A bridge is a device that connects two LANs and controls data flow between them. A switch is a networking device that learns which machine is connected to its port by using the device IP address. Then next is yung bridges and switches. So, to use bridges and switches, ganito lang gagawin natin. Same lang siya sa hub and repeaters. Kailangan natin ng two network design and connect them using a bridge device. So, maglalagay tayo ng dalawang switch with three workstation each. Sa workstation, gagamit tayo ng straight through cable. Connect lang natin siya. So, ayan. Then, makikita natin yung bridge kasama siya ng switches category. Click lang natin tong PT bridge. Then, gagamit tayo ng crossover cable. So, may pagkaparehas lang siya kay repeaters but the difference is bridge connects to network in a well-organized manner. Repeater expands the limit of the signals in the network. So, let's configure the workstation again. So, ayan. And after configuration, let's try to ping them again. So, ayan. Let's them let's try to ping them again. So, ayan, connected na siya. Routers and routers. A router is a networking device that is designed to receive Analyze and forward data packets between computer networks. A router is used to connect LAN or local area network and one or wide area network. A router is a networking device that functions both as bridge and a router. It can forward data between networks serving as a bridge but can also route data to individual systems within a network serving as a router. So, next naman is yung routers and routers. So, dito naman sa routers and routers is kailangan natin ng 3 routers tapos yung isa sa routers magsaserve siya as a bridge. So, let's start na natin mag-design. So, kailangan natin ng 3 routers and 1 workstation, left and right. So, dito, ang gagamitin natin na network media is crossover cable. Click natin yung router. Click natin tong fast Ethernet 00. Then, same lang sa workstation. Same process din dito sa kabila. Then, configure natin.
So, ayan. So, after natin ma-configure yung dalawang router, i-connect na natin siya dito sa isang router that serves as a bridge. Dito, hindi tayo gagamit ng straight through cable and crossover. Gagamitin natin tong serial DTE cable. Click lang natin. Click Click natin sa router. Then, click natin tong serial 2.0. And, click natin sa router ulit. At, i-click yung serial 2.0. Dito naman sa kabila, pipiliin natin yung serial 3. Then, start na natin i-configure. Click lang natin tong router. Then, yung serial 2.0. Then, maglalagay tayo ng IP address. <clears throat> Ayan. Pagkatapos, maglagay ng IP address. Click natin yung port status on. And, ilagay natin yung IP address dito sa RIP. Then, after na nyan, click natin yung browser. Then, punta tayo sa config. Same lang. Click lang natin yung serial 2. Then, maglagay tayo ulit ng IP address. Then, yung port status on. Then, ilagay natin yung IP address sa RIP. Then, after natin ma-config ma -config yung unang side, next naman yung kabilang side. Same lang ng process. Pero dito, click natin yung serial tree. Then, ayan. Serial tree. Then, after natin ma-configure, check natin kung connected na ba siya. <clears throat> Then, ayan. After natin ma Configure, check na natin kung connected na ba siya. Connected na siya through dito sa Add Simple PDU. Click lang natin. Then, click natin siya sa router. Then, click natin siya dito sa my workstation. So, makikita natin dito sa my button, right? Successful siya. Sabi niya, ibig sabihin, connected na siya. And, try natin i-connect si PC0 kay PC1. So, iping natin siya. So, ayan. Connected na. Gateway and security devices. Gateway is a device such as router that serves as the edge devices providing an access point to a 
access point to other network and is used to forward IP packets which does not match any routes in the routing table. Security devices helps prevents any unwanted access to the network to protect our to protect our network in Cisco Packet Tracer, we can see here that it has a device called Firewall to protect our network.